We're back again. It's the Three Pointers TV. Myself, the T's. Arsenal win. 3 0. Easy win, boys. I'm here with Jacob. Jacob and Louis, yeah? yeah That's it. Yeah. Excellent. Let's start with you, Jacob, man. What are your thoughts on the, tonight's game? What, was, what are your thoughts coming was, out of this game? I thought it was a good game. You know, we didn't play our strongest starting 11, obviously, being in Europa League. We've got to preserve our players for the big game on Sunday against Liverpool. I think some players did well for themselves. Namely Vieira, Rob Holding as well with, with a great header. Um, Reese Nelson, when he came on at the end as well, I didn't think he was too bad. He looked sharp, didn't he? He, he didn't look too bad at all. I thought he was going to pick up a goal. Unfortunately, he didn't. Yeah, but it's a shame he didn't pick up a goal there. It's what it is. Um, no, it was a good game, good to watch, and great experience night game. Their fans were crazy as well, by the way. It's yeah. good to experience that. Yeah, 3 0 win, can't really complain. How about you, Louis? What, which player stood out for you? I'll be honest, Rob Holden, since his trip to Turkey, he's been absolutely smashing it, man. Um, I was really impressed. Good to get a goal. Vieira, cultured. Obviously, really good to see Reese Nelson back on the pitch. And I think of like the starting 11 that started, uh, it was good to see them get sharp. And obviously, Kieran Tierney, very unlucky to be second choice, but he's a, a very good player. Were you, were you a little bit nervous going into the game? Because obviously, you know, they smashed Roma 6-1. People were talking about all of that stuff. I was more nervous about one of our big players getting injured, to be honest. I seen Shaka start and I'm just thinking, oh, if he gets feisty and gets all riled up, gets in a bit of a scrap with one of their players, not as in a fight, but as in like just tackling back and forth, then maybe he'll pick up an injury. And then I saw Odegaard, Jesus, everyone come on at the end and I was just thinking, uh oh. But I was never worried about the result. It was more about players getting injured. And uh, Louis, um, moving on now, we've got a Big game on Sunday, man. Um, luckily, I think the players, they came off unscathed. No injuries so far. We haven't heard anything yet, but yeah, kind of jumping the gun a little bit. But I mean, going into the next game, um, are you fairly confident that we could get something here at the Emirates? I think with Liverpool, they've always got Arsenal's number. But obviously, it eventually has to change. I think this will be a tough game in Tottenham. I think also Liverpool are a bit of a wounded animal um, and they've got something to prove. They've just come off the back of a good win in the Champions League. Jota's fit and he loves to score against Arsenal. Listen, you're always confident at the top of the league. Arteta's gotten playing, it's a good start on 11. But Liverpool, if there was a team, I think, to disrupt that rhythm, I think Liverpool will be will be the ones to do it. But saying that, top of the league, uh, you still got to be confident no matter what. So yeah. Uh, and how about yourself? What do you think going into the game? I'm on very on Sunday. I'm very nervous. I can't lie. It's a massive game. I know what it means to us because imagine, imagine we win. You know, the confidence. Big statement, right? Uh, Tottenham and Liverpool. If we can wipe both of them off early reasonably early in the season that would be something to say but like I say I'm a bit nervous and you know they, they still got the Salah they still got I don't even know they just got all these threatening players and um, I'm excited though because I really want to watch Martinelli versus Trent that will always be a good one and I hope Martinelli doesn't win because he's good at that and you saw Trent against Brighton you saw Trent against Fulham <laughs> alright nice one alright thanks guys do you want to just quickly Big love from Australia. Yeah, 6021 man. Sterling Perth West Side. You know how it is. Oh, Alright, that's nice one man. Do you wanna big up the three pointers? I'm big up the three pointers, the best yeah, fan TV on, at Arsenal. Come on boys. <laughs> <laughs> nah, thanks for having us. Lovely man. Big up the three pointers TV. The only three points. Don't touch that diet. Tune in. Cheers. Come on, peeps. What were you waiting for? Like, share, subscribe to the three pointers.